and welcome to another edition of Aya Food School. I'm Jamie and today we're going to talk about a sugary, sweet type of self-care and all these items to do this is uh, probably in your kitchen. So I'm going to share some things with you to help you enjoy taking care of yourself a little better and a little sweeter. And today I'm going to share um, a sugar scrub and a sugar salt scrub and one of them you can do for your face and another you can do for your body or just your hands and feet whatever you choose and it's really about being comfortable in our own skin quite literally and uh, if you have itchy dry skin um, and these days we wash our hands a lot and use a lot of hand sanitizer, which can lead to some cracking and drying of the skin and to the point of even bleeding. And these products, uh, again, which can be found in your kitchen, um, can help with that. So let's get into it. Basically, all you need is sugar, granulated sugar. You could use brown sugar or date sugar, which is I have here. And you can use salts of other of um, different types as well. You can use a Sea salt is best. You could use a coarse salt if you really like want to get in there for your feet and um, do a, a heavier exfoliant. Or you can use um, Himalayan pink salt as well. And I'll be using that one mixed with some granulated sugar for the body scrub. It's quite simple. So I have some date sugar in here and I had it available. It's not something I use very often. So, you know, utilizing what you have and uh, making it simple for yourself. So I have about a half a cup of date sugar in here and uh, a cup-ish of coconut oil. So I'm just gonna add those two things together. Now with the coconut oil, it's supposed to be melted and warm, but not hot. Because um, if you add hot coconut oil to your sugar or salt, of course it would dissolve and melt, and then it defeats the whole purpose of the scrub. So I also have some vanilla extract. So I'm just gonna use about a half a teaspoon of that. <clears throat> with the sugar and the coconut oil. That's just for scents, for good smell good. If you're into it, you don't have to use a vanilla extract or anything for that matter, but some things you can use are citrus zest. I wouldn't put this on your face. I wouldn't put um, like essential oils you can use and citrus zest. Um, I wouldn't put that on your face. That I will be using an essential oil for the body scrub. Um, but for the facial, um, I do like the smell of the vanilla extract and it's not too uh, potent of an ingredient that it's okay for the face. The thing about this is it'll last about three months in your cupboard, just store in a cool, dry place. The thing is uh, you don't wanna keep it out in the heat or you know where there's a heater duct or anything like that because you want to have it coagulate and harden a bit as it's stored. That way it stays uh, mixed. This is a basic facial scrub. Sugar, vanilla extract, and coconut oil. And oh, for a little extra moisturizer, I'm gonna put um, about a half a teaspoon of vitamin E oil in there as well. That's really good for the face. Helps with your skin texture, the collagen. With these sugar scrubs and salt scrubs, um, you can use them as gifts. You can share them with people as gifts and put, you know, make a little label with your, uh, with your chosen name, make it cute and cool. And, um, Put a little bow on it and you can give these as gifts. So now I'm just gonna let that sit for a little while. And then later, <clears throat> I'll just take out probably a tablespoon of it, you know, uh, lather it on the face. 
and then do a nice warm wash and pat it dry. You just want to pat it Continuing dry. Continuing on with self-care. <laughs> so I have some Himalayan pink salt, some granulated sugar, and it's about a half a cup of the dry ingredients and about a half a cup, third cup of warm, not hot, coconut oil. Now you could use grapeseed oil, you could use almond oil, and what is the other oil you can use? Um, almond, grapeseed, and coconut oil, basically. And brown sugar and date sugar are gentler on the skin. So you would use um, a brown sugar or a date sugar for the, the face and a granulated sugar for the body and foot scrub. Now this I have the salt and sugar blend. I wanted to get a little coarser um, product here for more exfoliant. Now you can do this across your whole body actually, make it very soft. And in this one, I am gonna add some essential oils. This is a eucalyptus because I'm gonna use this scrub for my feet, about 10 drops or so. And you can eyeball this, you know, you don't have to like get all technical with it. About a half teaspoon of vitamin E oil. Now I'm gonna mix that up. Ooh, that smells good. And this is a lovely form of self-care that you can do for yourself or others, you know, you could have like a trades party and um, get out your your scrubs and uh, and share a little foot massage, a little hand massage, and trade off. Now the thing about it, if you're gonna do it yourself, ideally you would do it in the shower, right? Um, but to sit down because if you know, the coconut oil starts uh, gathering on the bottom of the bathtub, it could be detrimental. <laughs> so <laughs> be smart about it. If you're gonna do a foot scrub, um, make sure you rinse really well. And if it does, you know, if you do find a, an oily residue in your, in your bathtub or your shower, getting rid of that with some vinegar, vinegar spray. Very simple. So then this, I think I got everything in there. I got vitamin E, uh, essential oil, quarter cup of uh, Himalayan pink salt, and then a quarter cup of granulated sugar, and then a cup of coconut oil, in this case. And ta-da, that's all it takes. Like two minutes can give you a wonderful product that can really improve your whole day. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing wrong with that. And again, you can share these as gifts. Um, you could do this for yourself on a daily basis and have really super soft, supple skin. And uh, yeah, pretty easy stuff. And just wanted to share those things with you. There we go. I have a body scrub and um, foot and foot and hand scrub on here. And then I have a facial scrub. So I look forward to. Uh, treating myself to a, a nice little facial <laughs> today <laughs> and uh, maybe even give myself, give my feet some love as well and uh, polish some toes. <laughs> Why not? Happy Saturday. All right, so that's it. Pretty simple stuff. All you need is coconut oil, almond oil, or grapeseed oil, um, sugar. You can use granulated date or brown. Brown and date are the gentlest for sensitive skin. Uh, for sea salt, uh, well, for the salt, use sea salt uh, ideally. Um, doesn't matter. The, the texture, course, is good as well. You can also do this with coffee. Now, I didn't have any coffee. I really wanted to make a coffee scrub, and that's great for the body. And it's the same, same, you just, um, you add, it's a one-to-one -one ratio as far as coconut oil. So if you have a half cup of coconut oil, then you would use a half cup of the um, coffee grounds. And again, you don't wanna have hot coconut oil when you're doing this, um, like warm it up, melt it, and let it sit so it's not hot, so it doesn't dissolve the sugar or the salt. And that's that, or much less the, co the coffee if you use that. And for scents, if you wanna add scents, you can, um, use uh, citrus zest um, and again for the body scrub you can do essential oils and um, I think that's it 
yeah, and avoid slipping. It's the big thing. Don't slip. If you have a residue of oil in your shower or bathtub, just use a vinegar spray and wipe it out. No problem. That's that. Add some vitamin E for a little extra or some jojoba oil for a little extra. Pretty simple. I don't know what else to say except uh, enjoy this day and enjoy taking care of you and those around you with much love and sugary sweetness. This is a great way to uh, spend a, spend some time taking care. All right, so that's it for this edition of Aya Food School. Thank you so much for watching the video. And there's more stuff on Instagram. And uh, as far as food goes, I do a lot more on Instagram. And then it's under Aya Food School, A-Y-A, which stands for As You Are. And it's, yeah, showing up for yourself as you are and giving yourself the, the best attention possible because it's your life you choose. Hope you enjoy and share the word. Much love to you. Have a great, great weekend and enjoy this day as you are. Take care. Bye-bye.